I'm Stoker Devonshire and I'm lucky enough to live at Chatsworth, which is one of the four destinations of the exhibition we call the Grand Tour. The well-off people of England and of Europe in the 16th, 17th, 18th century. Their objective was to get to Italy, which was the sort of sinecure of taste and a lot of works of art were bought uh, and brought back to England. And in fact, you can see the results of these shopping sprees in practically every historic house in England, certainly here at Chatsworth. It must have been very interesting, very exciting and a wonderful way to learn about classical architecture, classical art, classical culture. For season one of the Grand Tour, we are looking at architecture. We're looking at architecture through the eyes of contemporary architect Rem Koolhaas, who curated the Venice Biennale about architecture in 2014. Right, he did his own grand tour of sorts. And while he was in Rome and out in Naples, he was making copious studies of the antiquities uh, and the landscape that, that he viewed while he was there. And then he used these studies as a stock which he would draw from for the rest of his life. You'll um, see an artist that is deeply knowledgeable about this period in the visual arts and the decorative arts and very conscious of how displaced they feel in, in an environment like ours, which is in such contrast to the amazing environments of an interior like Chatsworth. Uh, Chatsworth have been so generous, they've loaned works that are of I mean, incalculable value, things that are extremely rare. People that visit Chatsworth or visit Notting to understand a little bit through my work how and why architecture makes us move in a particular way. In Nottingham, my work will embed itself around the decorative objects, will form a part of it, will relate to the decoration a lot more. So in season one, we're going to have a part one reveal. So we're going to be showing people um, what these paintings look like now in their current condition. Um, one of the Colosseums, the Colosseum by Daylight it's called, um, has had a little treatment done to it already. Um, and we'll be talking about that process. The connection with, with Welbeck is that for the corridor section of that exhibition, Coolhouse felt that the 19th century architecture and the network of tunnels that are here represented some kind of apotheosis of corridor. And he was allowed rare access into not only the private house that is Welbeck Abbey, but also the underground tunnels that are contained here. The Grand Tour concept, it's being driven by tourism to come and spend at least one if not two nights in this lovely part of England and see things which they perhaps weren't aware of, go to places uh, which they didn't know too much about because they're drawn in by the concept of the Grand Tour. The 21st century interpretation of the Grand Tour is bringing together contemporary things with old things, something which I passionately excited about. Everybody will enjoy it and I'm sure that they will be thrilled by the revelations that it produces.